Greetings, people of the internet. I'm Scott with Circworks Art Labs. Welcome to the Underground Laboratory where we create robots, aliens, zombies, and other imminent threats to humanity. Today is one of those days, though, where we're not going to necessarily work on those, but we're going to work on comics. Yes, because it is day what? what? What day is it? It is day... Day six. <laughs> Day six. Am I supposed to pull that off yet? No. That's the end. That's what we're supposed to do at the end, if you haven't seen the show. So anyway, day six of 100 days of making comics. And what is 100 days of making comics? Well, it's where I put aside 30 minutes a day every day to work on my own personal comic book project. That is Young and the Dead. So Young and the Dead, we've got issues. Oh. We've got three issues available. One through three right here. And uh, we also have, uh, now you, I've shown these off quite a bit, but I've got another version of my comic book that's also on my store. These are the mini comics. I love mini comics. Now, I go all out with mini comics. If you've seen any of my videos, I got videos on how to make mini comics or you should make mini comics, stuff like that. So if you've seen those, you probably know what I'm talking about. But yeah, I put a lot of work, a lot of TLC goes into these. So this is issue one, issue two, issue three of the mini comic. Um, they're deluxe versions. They're a little pricey, but a lot of hand, uh, a lot of DIY goodness has gone into these things. So um, hopefully... Hopefully you guys will want to check these out. And if you do, they're available at my website at surfworks.com. But enough with the sales pitch. Let's get on to the actual making of comics. Now that we're at day six, uh, we've made some progress. It's coming along. I'm really happy with the way it's coming along. I think it's coming along faster at this point. We're still early in the game, but I think it's coming along a lot faster than it did on the first round. Because if you didn't know, this is round two for me of 100 Days of Making Comics. Now, there's people out there that Kevin Cross have done it like four times. Okay, you know, well he started it. And there's other people out there that have done more, more than me. I, I waited a little bit here. I've got other stuff I'm doing. I do prints and all kinds of other stuff. Get off my back. But anyway, so we're gonna get back to, <laughs> I gotta catch up with these guys is basically what I'm saying. So how am I gonna do that? How am I gonna do that? There's no other way but to make comics and make them as fast as I can. So with that, we're gonna go to the Parallelscope we're going to check out where I am in the process of 100 Days of Making Comics. Round 2, Day 6. Let's go to it. I've been on this diet, so so far I've lost uh, over 20 pounds, and I'm trying, to, I'm trying to hit my goal of like 35 pounds. So I just I figured I'd show you guys what I'm doing. This is, the, this is the program that I'm using. It's called the Shred Diet. This is the, I guess, the doctor that used to be on that Celebrity Fit Club a while back. Um, I don't know if it's like a, a thing anymore, like as popular, but I tried it a while back and I lost some weight. And then after you know, a few years, I gained it back. So I just decided to track this book down and go and uh, try it again. And it's been successful for me again. Now, the, the thing, if you're, if you're interested in trying this out, this guy has like, I don't know, eight or ten books. They're all named about the same. And uh, so this one is called the Shred Revolutionary Diet. And I've got, what I do is I've got uh, this, just a little chart here that says what I can eat. So I'm actually, I'm, I'm getting ready to go to work. Last night I, I got some of my stuff ready to, to take to work. But I figured I'd kind of show you what this diet entails. So... Uh, you start off with, uh, well for breakfast today, this one's a weird one because I, I can have, one of the things I can have is grilled cheese. So I'm going to grill myself a grilled cheese. That one's kind of weird, but most of the stuff's kind of, uh, you know, your standard real light kind of fare. Uh, but throughout the day you have like three different snacks. They have to be like 100 calories or 150 calories. Uh, so after I eat the grilled cheese, I've got a 100 calorie snack. So that's this... They're just called seafood snackers. They're these little imitation crab things. And this whole thing is like 80 calories right here. And I got a little cocktail sauce to go along with that. Then for one of my meals, just a uh, grilled chicken, a small, about the, size, about the size of like a pack of cards. Um, then let's see, so like carrots and hummus. And for another one of my snacks, this is just uh, like a little PB&J on uh, like whole wheat, like a flatbread kind of bread toast thing here. Um, an apple. 
And what else? So uh, a lot of soups and smoothies. So I got a can of, of soup. This is, uh, for this can, it's like, this one's eight, this one's a little over, I think. No, it's one, yeah, two servings at 80 calories each. So that one's a little over, but I think I'm good with that. And you know, I got a couple of salads. I'm actually packing this stuff for two days because I'm going to work and then I'm going to my girl girlfriend's house and then I go back to work the next day from there. So I need to pack two days worth. Um, and then what else? Uh, let's see. Yeah, just this, just the salads and uh, along with the chicken, I got a sweet potato and vegetable. And I had a, uh, I don't know, I had oh this some asparagus here. So that's pretty much, other than the dinners, cause the dinner I'll, I'm gonna be at my girlfriend's and then the next night, I'll be, tomorrow night I'll be back here. So I'll make dinner here. So that's about it. The only other thing there's uh, I gotta make a couple of smoothies, but uh, this is my banana thing and it can't have smoothies without bananas. So I'm going to the store to get some bananas. You have to be kidding me. There are literally no bananas. <laughs> oh my God. So I went over the frozen aisle to find bananas that weren't any frozen bananas. But look, when I got back, a brand new shipment. All right, I did get, <laughs> I did get the bananas. That was crazy. So uh, let's see. So here's pretty much what I got for my smoothie. Ah. Got some uh, strawberries. Get the, some bananas in there. Fortunately, they're kind of, they're not totally ripe, but. I'll take what I can. Got some frozen, what is this? Uh, just mixed berries and stuff. You know, frozen berries in there. This is, this is a pretty big smoothie. This is gonna be like two days worth. Then uh, got some Greek yogurt. A couple ah, big spoonfuls of that. And I'm gonna put a little bit of regular yogurt in there. Got some uh, whey protein. And of course, some milk in there. Put that lid in. Let's let go. There we go. Powered up. That should do it. So if you haven't realized by now, this round for 100 Days of Making Comics, I'm gonna be doing a little more vlogging, kind of my daily life, what's going on. And uh, so hopefully you guys are digging that. But uh, with that being said, I am still working on the comic book. I am knee deep in Manga Studio, trying to learn how this software works and everything. And I'm really, really digging it. I think this is gonna be a super powerful tool for me. And um, yeah, I'm, I'm loving this course and I can't wait to wait to learn this whole thing so I can uh, I can do a lot more work in Manga Studio. But anyway, so that's what I'm doing today for 100 Days of Making Comics and I will see you guys later. And we are back, yes. And I already pulled this thing off earlier because I messed up I'm forgetting the whole process. But I didn't crumple it up yet, so that's what we do. So just to celebrate, just this is just the way that we put this day to a bet to rest, and we say this day is done. Let's move on to the next. We crumble that up and we throw it in the trash, and that means day tomorrow. Day tomorrow. Day tomorrow. <laughs> okay. <laughs> this is what happens when you don't edit these. <laughs> day tomorrow. No, that, I, that was two things. I said day, and then I stopped myself. And then I said tomorrow, but it sounded like the same thing I said before. Anyway, I'm, I'm going all over the place. Tomorrow is day seven, the end of the week. So we'll get tomorrow with tomorrow. That's going to be the end of this week. One week. We'll have one week down. Can you believe that? This is going so fast. Um, but why are we waiting around? Let's, let's, let's go do, go do whatever else you're going to do. You got lots of stuff to do. Why are you here hanging around with me? Anyway, I'll see you tomorrow for day seven. That is all. Thank <laughs> you.
Hey everyone, you've seen the process, now you can check out the story. Issues 1 through 3 of Young and the Dead are available at my website at circworks.com. Also follow me on social media at the links listed below. Subscribe and check out some of the other videos in the series, there's much more to come.